Hey, what's going on? JD here, and today's tutorial will be for Final Cut Pro. You guys have been asking how to do the letterbox transition that has been seen many, many times in Peter McKinnon videos and Casey Neistat videos. You know that portion of their video where they ramp things up to sort of that cinematic B-roll kind of like this? So we're going to show you how to do the letterbox transition in Final Cut Pro. It is very straightforward, very easy to do to give your video kind of that more cinematic look. There are things that you can do to make your footage look more cinematic, like shoot in 24 frames per second. Uh, you can also add this letterboxing, which is the 2.35 to 1 ratio that a lot of films are shot in. And then when they are converted to be things like DVDs or for your television set, especially the older sets that had the old four to three ratio, they would black out the tops and bottoms so it had that cinematic aspect still. So we're going to show you how to do that. It is straightforward and really easy to do. So what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down to the crop and what we're going to do is we're going to keyframe the beginning of the footage, both the top and bottom to zero. And then we're going to move the cursor over. We're going to say about two or maybe three seconds is where we're going to go. And then we're going to go back to the crop box here. And we're going to keyframe those sections. So one and two. But we're going to change the values. You can either use the slider and slide up or you can click and scroll in and we're going to type in 132. That will give us close to the 2.35 aspect ratio. Uh, so when we play our video now, we see it just slowly goes in until it hits that keyframe and then it will continue the entire way through the clip. So that is a quick and easy way to do the letterbox transition in Final Cut Pro. Only takes a few seconds. Just remember to utilize keyframes. If you want to zoom out, so you want to go from letterbox to full screen, you just simply reverse the process. Have a keyframe with the letterbox settings and then go to zero and you should be able to expand to full screen. So thanks again for tuning in guys. Remember smash that like button, hit subscribe. And if there is anything that you want to see tutorial wise, by all means, let me know in the comments below and uh, give us a thumbs up if this helped you until next time. See ya.